Okay, we have written our integral from the Swin B 2018, problem five. We have the integral of one plus e to the x over e to the x minus one dx. Okay, now I definitely wanna do a u substitution on this, but if you just do it right away and we just call this our u, we get back an e to the x, but we don't get back this one. So I think what I wanna do instead is let's put this on the plus sign and split it into two integrals. And I think it's a little easier that way. So for our first one, we're just gonna have the one e x minus one. And then for the second one, see the second one's gonna be set up the way we want it because we already have our u substitution set up. So for this one, we'll just go ahead and call this the u. So we'll have u equals e to the x minus one du equals e to the x dx. So doing that, we're all set with our du right there. So this one's gonna be easy. But in this other integral, we don't have anything in the numerator. So our u substitution, it's not quite as easy but I'll just create that. What I'll do is, if I just multiply by one by multiplying by e to the minus x over e to the minus x, let's see what happens here. So now we get something in the numerator. Multiplying e to the x times e to the minus x is one minus e minus x. And this one, I think I'll just copy it down for the moment. Now for this here, now I think we're in good shape for this substitution. We'll do, we already used u, so let's just call this v. So we'll say v equals one minus e minus x. Take a derivative, now dv, derivative of one, zero. Derivative of this is gonna be minus e minus x. Chain rule, derivative of minus x is minus one. This becomes a plus, and then we get a dx. But then we have our dv right here. So what we have is the integral of dv over v and the integral of du over u. So we really have the same integral with different substitutions. So let's just do these together. So one over v, this is gonna give me natural log absolute value of v, and this one's gonna be natural log absolute value of u. We just need to back substitute here and here. So let's see what we have. We got natural log, our v value, one minus e minus x, and then here we got, this is gonna be e to the x minus one. And now we can just leave our solution this way, but I think what I'd rather do is use log properties and what we can do is combine these two and multiply these together. I'm just gonna need a little more space on the board. Okay, so now here, all I need to do, we're just gonna combine this into one natural log. I'm just gonna distribute this out. So let's see what happens. One times e to the x is e to the x minus the middle terms. This is gonna give me e to the zero or just one. One times minus one, minus one, minus one times minus e to the x plus e minus x. And so I'll just put everything together. So for the final solution, we're gonna have natural log e to the x plus e minus x minus two plus c, and that's it. So there you have it, Swinby 2018, problem five. Thanks everyone for watching, have a good day.